What's up, y'all? It's your boy Leon Mtukulu, the South African Geek. Welcome to my channel. Today, I'm gonna dive right into Into the Badlands, episode 2, chapter 18. The moon rises, Raven seeks. Basically, this was Pilgrims. I think that's what his name is Pilgrims episode and his old click. The new Azra. That's what they're looking for. It was a nice dynamic seeing it. Seeing that his. Minions, those two people in the first episode who cut themselves and were awesome as hell. There's consequences to using that ability, the avatar state, as I call it. Uh, let's talk about the cinematography of the show, yo. When they went into that whole garden setup, I was like, yo, this is beautiful. This is appealing to look at, you know what I'm saying? And then you saw them look over the cliff and the mountain top. It was just a beautiful episode at the beginning, no lie. And the costume design, like yo, the show gotta get its props. And we also got Nathaniel getting his new hand at the widow's best forger made. It looked cool as hell with the butterfly thing on the side. Um the widow, let's talk about the widow for a second, yo. The widow's turning into somebody very unlikable. Yo, like her quest to get power and to use MK to get power is just messed up to see. And MK all drugged up and stuff with all those bags under his eyes. MK needs help. But that fight between MK and Nathaniel was lit, yo. The fight scenes in the show keep getting better and better. There wasn't that much fight scenes in this episode, but it was still lit. We also got to talk about Henry's uh, Sonny's son having the gift also. Because Sonny also had the gift, apparently, in his past. Because they found him with that medallion. I was wondering when they were going to address that fact. And they did. Like, Bungie was so hesitant about helping Sonny. Because helping Sonny means going to his master. How does Lydia know so much about the past of uh, Ezra and all these gifts and whatnot. Was that the religion she was part of? Is that what she was taught all those years under her father's thumb? The Iron Rabbits were so cool. That's a dope name, yo. Give it up for Tilda and the Iron Rabbits. Also, uh, Pilgrim and his new clique living in some museum talking about paradise. Also, when he had that cool ass fight sequence where he was blindfolded. Yeah, there was more than one fight sequence now that I remember. He, he was cool. Tilda. Am I tripping the actress that plays Tilda? So beautiful. Like, that whole bangs they used to give her when she worked for. The widow didn't give her justice. She's very beautiful. Let's talk about MK and his drug use, though. And that trippy moment he had where he had to face off with his darker side, his avatar state, that led him to find out that Sonny killed his mother. Yo, that was a trippy moment. Like, goddamn. I mean, like, yo, that's gonna be a rift in their relationship. I wonder how that's gonna die. But also, Nathaniel and Lydia having a big past. I mean, probably because he was regent of Quinn and stuff like that. And I wonder if Lydia is going to take the Widow's deal on the Iron Rabbits. And does the Black Widow know that the Iron Rabbits is her old regent? I doubt that because I don't think she'll call for their heads. The end sequence with that whole hanging her up and she's like, I see everything. That was oh, goosebumpy. I was gonna find a promo for the next episode, but couldn't. I only could find the promotional pictures, and I, I'm not gonna react to the promotional pictures. So yeah, that's not gonna happen. But I really enjoyed this episode. I give it an eight out of ten. It was fantastic. It was getting every. We were getting to know everybody's point of view and where they are six months later and what their goal is and what they want. And Sunny just wants to be a dad. I don't understand. Sunny Savage. Not even mentioning MK1 stuff. Uh, subscribe if you're not subscribed. Uh, deuces.